Hey guys, I'm gonna try to vlog today. I have tried to vlog a few times, but then my footage was always like really, really loud. And so I never actually uh, did it. <laughs> today I'm hoping to do a reading vlog. I'm just leaving work, so I'm gonna go home, eat some lunch, read. I'm almost done with my book, so I'll check in with you guys in about 20 minutes when I go home. Okay? Okay, bye. Home sweet home. I'm gonna make some lunch. Change out of my slacks. As comfy as they are, I need to have them cleaned for tomorrow. And then I'm gonna read. The book I'm reading right now is The Gilded Wolves by Roshani Chosky. Chok, Chokshi. Roshani Chokshi. This was my one of my February book of the month books. Uh, I got another one, which I'm hoping to get to after. I am almost done. Almost done. Can you see my messy bathroom over there? I'm a messy kind of person. So hoping to get this one finished today and I'll let you guys know uh, how it goes. Lunch first. We are going out of town in a few days. So we're really trying to focus on just eating what we have <laughs> instead of eating out as much as I want. Cafe Rio or... I literally just want Cafe Rio right now. Something I've been enjoying recently are these chicken teriyaki bowls. Get them at Costco. Pretty good. I eat them all the time at work. You just pop them in the microwave for about five minutes. So while that's cooking, I'm gonna go change my clothes. I'm all changed. I got this super cool Marauder's Map t-shirt courtesy of Hot Topic. I went a little hard on their site a couple weeks ago. No regrets. Lunch time. Supposed to sit for three minutes. <laughs> mm, I'm too impatient, so. It's hard to eat and hold a book at the same time. So usually while I eat, uh, I watch the Game Grumps. Okay, I've had my lunch. I'm all cozied up. I've got snacks over here, my water's over there. Cozy blanket, some pillows, ambient lighting. I'm on page 295 out of 388. No, that's the acknowledgements. 386. So just under 100 pages left to go in The Gilded Wolves. I've liked what I've read so far. I felt like in the beginning there was a lot of exposition. It felt really forced of this is the history that these people have and this is why they feel uncomfortable or whatever. It's kind of magical realism. It takes place in real places in Paris in the 18th century, I believe. I'm not sure what year this book takes place. Stop getting my pages wet. I cut my hand today and my band-aid's so wet. I'm washing my hands. Okay, yeah, it's in the, the 17th and 18th century. There are a lot of similar a lot of similar histories. It talks about Napoleon and the British Empire and, the, and that kind of thing. But also the people have magic abilities called forging and they're able to build objects. I'm not sure how the magic system works exactly. That's not really explained. It's interesting so far. The chapters are told by different characters. We followed them closely. It's still in third person, but we are able to zoom in and be in a close third person during certain events for certain characters. I feel like there's great representation. There's a woman from India. There's a man. I'm pretty sure he's, uh, he's Spanish and uh, he's bisexual. I mean, there's a, a good cast of people, lots of diversity. I'll get going on these last 100 pages and uh, talk. Okay, I'm on page 312 and my body is demanding that I take a nap. <laughs> I'm all cozy, warm belly. And uh, for my usual naps, I also nap here, and I have the Game Grumps on in the background while I sleep. So, it, it this my current 
setup is signaling to my body that it's time for a nap. So I'm going to sleep for just a little bit, a little while, and then I'll come back in and I will finish this book. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> um, that was a nice little hour and a half. Or so. I <laughs> don't know how long that nap was. It was nice, though. I fell asleep almost immediately. <laughs> and then I slept really hard and didn't move. Till my alarm went off. I was just gonna go back to sleep. But I don't want to. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so when I fell asleep... Like, it's not that it's a boring part of the book. Like, it's this is like a pretty high stakes... <laughs> I get into the end of the book and it's pretty high stakes and I shouldn't have fallen asleep. That's just my body. My body makes me sleep a lot. So I'm now on page 312. So we've got about 70 pages left to go. Is that math? Yeah. I can do this. So, I'm going to continue reading. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, I am now through with The Gilded Wolves by Rishani Chosky. The ending definitely left it open for uh, another book in the series that hasn't officially... I don't think the title's been announced, but I know that we are getting another one. Kind of a heartbreaking ending in a lot of ways. Not wanting to give spoilers or anything, but it was a little shocking. And then just to see the way that people deal with grief was interesting. I would recommend The Gilded Wolves. I thought it was a great, a great read. I hadn't read anything like it before, so uh, looking forward to the next book whenever that's announced. Because this was my first month with Book of the Month, I got a free book. So I have one more book to read that they have sent me, which is Early Riser. So I'm probably going to start that one. Thanks for watching my reading vlog. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll see you guys next time. If you like this format of video, let me know. Um, I haven't done anything like this before. So make sure you subscribe to my channel before you go. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!